Hello everyone, I feel like I need to reintroduce myself as we've gained a lot of subscribers recently and it's actually been nearly two months since I made a video where I've just talked to you guys which isn't really good enough. So uh, my name is Comrade or Lock Rules In Game and I'm one of the lead builders and the founder of Epic Quest. Um, you're probably wondering what I'm doing here. I'm currently working on Breland and the surrounding area. This here is Chatwood, this is a forest that connects on to Bree. I've decided I want to keep you guys more up to date with the projects that me and the rest of the team are working on. Uh, I'm aiming for sort of like two to three videos a week. Uh, I like to make tutorials, just updates, um, as well as still making all the cinematics and all the other world downloads that we make already. So I'll start off with what we're doing right now, and that is Chatwood, uh, Bree, Archet, and I'll, I'll just show you what I'm doing. Just so you get an idea of the scale, right here is this area. I'll just jump down, um, you can sort of see, uh, it's, it's a fairly large square. And then if we jump into the dynamic map, you can see me there. Um, that's where I was just a moment ago. And you can see all of these little dots, or these green dots are separate trees that we've planted. All our custom trees, you can see one of our builders there as well. Um, right here we have Bree. Um, this is the, the main area that we're going to be making. We haven't really started much on it yet. So you can't see any houses, but we've got plans for a particular house we're going to build, hobby holes, everything like that. And you can see here, we've actually finished completely arch it, which I'll show you in a minute. And you can see how big this forest is actually going to be. Um, this isn't even one of the largest forests in Middle Earth. This is, in reality, quite a small forest. Um, we've got Midgewater Marshes over here, um, which none of which we've started yet. Um, and he, to be honest, it's going to take us quite some time to finish all of this forest. This here is Archet, a small village project which I had the design on. I had quite a few builders to help me out though, such as Dwight, Carl, Gomba, Stormray. If I'm forgetting anyone, I'm really, really sorry. There were quite a few people that did help out and helped give him minor, minor roles. Just want to show you around the map on foot, so I'll just take a step inside. Um, and let's go into one of the buildings. Everything that we've made has got interior inside. Uh, just to show you, just one in particular. Oh, I don't see you have to get down. Why can't I get down? Because I'm flying. There we go. Going up, and we've got a little bit of an Easter egg here. I haven't actually seen this. Um, what we got in here? Watch out for monsters. Right. Okay, fair enough. I'm um, not really too sure who made that, but that's a cool little easter egg. Uh, I'll go show you another house as well. Close the door. Don't want to let any monsters in. Um, which house should I go into? I think you can see interior in there. Uh, let's go inside this one. Have I got up here? Got some faces. Um, I believe here all the heads of people that helped out making Archet. Um, we'll go up again. Okay, that's probably about it. Take a step outside. Right, what else? Um, we've got the town hall here. Town hall level 10. Prepare the Inferno Towers. A Clash of Clans reference there. Yeah. Quite a cool little village. The last thing that I wanted to show you guys is the path from Archit to um, Bree. Sorry, I nearly forgot the name of it then. Um, now, this is actually quite a long journey. Speed, five. Okay, so we can go a bit quicker. Uh, and I just take you along the path that you take to get from Archit to Bree. And you can pass through all the forest and just have an idea of how much time it probably take us to, to build each tree manually. Although, that said, we are using world edit, so we are world editing in each tree um, just by a click, it will plant tree. Actually, I'll come out here and I'll, I'll show you. I'll, I'll show you if I just go like that, then a tree has been planted, and I've got a random tree. I've got tree number nine. Uh, I think there's 14 trees in total, and we've got um, different rotations. So if I plant another one with that one, then I've got rotation of zero, and I've got tree number 11. So I'll try and get back onto the path if I can even find it again now. And which way did I come? Hmm. Part of the confusion. Okay, so we carry on going. If I go back to Archit now, I'm going to be a bit disappointed. 
and we go up here. And we've come to a watchtower. Um, this actually signals a halfway point. Um, Archet watchtower. Oh, cool. Uh, have a quick look. Yeah, very nice. Okay, back onto the road again, I think. I hope it's this way. Hmm, actually, I think I've lost my way a little bit. No, it's down here, I think. Yep, we found the path again. Off we go. Hmm. Yeah, I seem to be losing the path a little bit. Very confusing. Oh god, is it down here? Yeah. Maybe we need to make that path a little bit more defined. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I found it once more. And up. Oh. I don't want to get lost. Don't know what lurks around these woods at night. Um. Oh god. Which way did I come? Okay, this isn't probably a very good example. I'm just getting lost. Um, I'll just fly out here. How far away am I? I am going in the completely wrong direction. Uh, the watchtower is over there. I'm going to presume, let's say that I got this route right, it should go here. I should type today. Speed of five. Go a bit faster, but five is fast enough. Bree should be somewhere over here, eventually, once you get past all the trees. We found the path. No, I think it's this way. You know what? I'm just going to walk. Turns out I was going the completely wrong direction. Um, Bree's actually all the way over here, and I was sort of flying off over this direction here. Um, the watchtower is just over there. Um, this here is Bree. We haven't actually got much in here, so there's not really much point me showing you around. But we've got the gate, and we've um, lined out the fort, and we've got a bit of the terrain sorted. Um, maybe next time we'll be showing a breed. Thank you for watching.